Monday morning, grateful to be here. Good morning to all of you that are tuning in. I appreciate you for watching today's video. Before I get started, don't forget to drop a like. I would always appreciate that. Think about subscribing if you're not subscribed yet. I make Molin content every single day and this is another Molin video and I'm gonna show you some things that Molin has posted and some things with the charts and what is going on. Right now we are red. Now that might be a positive thing even though that sounds crazy because no more green pre-market and then crash down. Like, let's just find a floor. Let's find a base. Let's see what's gonna be happening today and moving forward this week. We have new interviews, apparently, with certain people that are saying the deal is completely done with Mullen and LH, which is a positive thing. If it is true, I would love to see an 8K, some documents, anything that's telling us that, hey, this is legit and this is Mullen moving forward. And I think we deserve it, right? We are at... 42.91 as a pre-market. This stock has been completely destroyed, but let's get into more details in this video this morning. Before I get started though, don't forget to grab your coffee. Here's mine. You know, none of this is financial advice. I'm not an advisor. You got to do your research at the end of the day. This will be the most memorable summer of my life, I think. I'm sure it will be for a lot of you as well. The question is, is it going to be a good summer or a worse summer than where we're at right now because it's June 12th as I'm making this video. Molin put this out on a Sunday. We hope everyone is having a fantastic weekend. Summer is finally here. Where's the road taking you? The question, Molin, is where's the road taking you? Because we would love to know where the road is taking us, but we have no idea at this point, right? I've shared the charts with you guys, oversold on every single time frame, especially the four hour daily and the weekly time frame. Actually, let me just check real quick. The weekly because we are thinking more long term now with Mullen. So the RSI is at 3049. I'll tell you one important thing on the weekly. 2910 is what you want to understand on the weekly time frame. That was the last point where we sold off completely. And then at this point, we actually ran 200%. This was October of 2022. Okay, so on the weekly time frame when the RSI was at 29 ish. Uh, that's where we ran right now. We're at 30 and a half on the RSI. And I've shared the daily with you and the four hour. So we'll see what happens next. I think the exciting thing about Mullen stock is we know what is done before. We know it can run again on significant news. I've been sharing to get out of this hole that we're in. I do believe we need a really, really good piece of news that's kind of like shocks the system, that shocks everybody like, oh shoot, where did this come from? That's the type of news we need. Seems like David wants to prove himself. He said multiple times on different videos, he aspires to be like Elon Musk. Um, Tesla is the goat basically. You know, Elon works hard every day. You have to earn that. It seems like he has painted this perfect picture for everyone. And now it's the summer and now we're entering production. Mullen is still marketing on social media. They've been consistent with that. So now it's just the stock price. That's the only negative thing about this company that I see right now, along with other things, obviously, like these uh, warrants and um, those people that I shared with you on one of my videos um, that own majority, a lot of shares of Mullen Company. But I think moving forward, I think this is the summer that Mullen could turn it around. And I think a lot of forgiveness can come from a lot of people that have really invested a lot of their money into this company that really believed in Mullen and the future outlook for them. Again, it really comes down to production in my opinion. Of course, if we get any type of news this week that really shocks everybody, that could be a good start to get us out of this hole trading at 42.98 right now. Well, I just found out news just broke, so I'm gonna be making another video update on that. But as I'm telling you this right now, pre-market now, we are actually green. So we'll see what happens. I'll break this down in a minute. All right, this just came out. Um, don't forget to like this video and we'll see you on the next one.